in terms of the designs, we have the mother hen, which represents um, an old woman with the uh, um, um, an old woman who has really taken very good care of the children. So the number of chicks we build under it re represent the number of children the person has when um, she was alive. Yes, and um, we have the, the spider, all the um, um, crab. We say they represent the two term of a particular thing, which um, goes with the elderly person, or let's say the abusampeni of that family. Yes, we also have uh, the wooden and plane, which goes with the occupation um, of the disease. Let's say if the disease happens to be a carpenter. Yes, we also have the film projector um, for an old film producer or something. We have the tomato for the tomato seller. We have the corn for a farmer who farms corn and many, many, many other things. Uh, previously, when tradition was really stronger, uh, no one would really love to bury his relatives in, in a beer bottle. But now, as you can see, we are in a computer world, so everyone feels it is very open and he wants to do something, you know, to make, to make, to be, for him to be the first to have done it. So these days, it looks like um, it's becoming more and more familiar with people using the cigarettes and um, um, the beer bottle and the Coke bottle. But normally what I used to know was if someone is going to be buried in a beer bottle, then it's someone who works with a company. But now I can see people who really loves it also could be buried in that. Usually when it's, it's finished, what we, we really want to see or hear is more of the comments. So when I go for a funeral like that, I just be in the midst of the people who don't know I was the one who prepared the coffin. So they just, you know, give their comments and then out of that, I think um, that really brings the motivation. Yeah, I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm going to